Hi everybody, so as you can see, um, I'm here at a Wobble Dogs video, um, but we aren't going to be playing Wobble Dogs today. Instead, I'm here to address, I guess you could call it some sort of issue that has been happening. So as you guys can see down here, I've gotten um, a lot of really nice requests from you guys for names. Um, and wobble dog codes seem to be a problem um because as you can see here um this has happened on a couple videos where this person carmelo parker parker has tried sending a wobble dog code um but it hasn't been working and i think that it is because Perhaps, um, I have links disabled here so that no one can post anything, um, like any links that might give you a virus or anything like that. Um, so, I don't know, I just wanted to kind of address this issue so that you guys could actually send me codes if you wanted. So, I'm just going to go through the steps to, um, doing this, and alright, let's get into it. Okay guys, so step one to sending me a Wobble Dogs code is you actually need to have Wobble Dogs and to have Wobble Dogs, um, you need to have a, um, a PC or a Mac or just a computer, um, and you can find it on Steam. Um, Steam things go on sale a lot too, so, um, you don't have to worry about it if you want to get it for cheaper. Um, I got it on sale, so it's pretty cheap. So, yeah, first of all, if you want to send me a Wobble Dog code, you actually need to have Wobble Dogs and you need to have a game. Okay, guys, so the next step, as you can see, I'm here in Wobble Dogs. I'm not going to go for too long so that uh, anything exciting happens. So, if you can see where my cursor is, this storage icon over here. If you click on that, you will be able to see all of your dogs. No clue what this means. Absolutely no clue. Um, but... If we can find... Oh dear, I think I broke it. That's fine. Um, give me... Hold on. Okay, let me go back in. There we go. So, as you can see, this is bacon that I copied the code of. So, all you guys have to do is click on one. Uh, I'll just go to bacon. Export dog and press copy. Okay, so then it'll say dog code copied. Press OK, and then you guys can exit out of Wobble Dogs. Where did they all go? Oh, they must be on the dog then. <laughs> Um, yeah, so then you can just click up here and exit out of Wobble Dogs once you have copied a code. Okay guys, so next you're want, going to want to go into Gmail, and if you need the address, um, it's this part right here. Um, not all of this, this is just so I can keep everything private. Um, so this is the link if you just search up gmail on your google search then i'm sure that it should work um perfectly fine and you'll be able to find gmail it'll look like this um so then you're going to want to go up here to compose and for this you need to have a google account so i assume if you're able to comment um then you are going to be able to uh, do this so go to compose and then in the to section you're going to type in nature wolf 21 at gmail.com um so as you guys can see that is my um gmail right there at the top right and just title it um wobble dog code so that I can kind of be organized. Okay, so then you can say like, you know, hi, 
here is a wobble dog code. This is just my example. You guys can put whatever you want. And there we go. So I just pasted this in here. It's going to look like a completely random code. Um, okay, so then you have that. And then you can say, like, bye. Okay. Then um, just hit send. And that will um, send it to me. So um, if I refresh, um, I don't believe it will come to me, but because it's me, but um, yeah, so that's how you guys can send your Wobble Dog code to me. Um, so remember, it is this right here, naturewolf21 at gmail.com. This is my Gmail. Um, I don't believe it's case sensitive, um, but just make, your, make sure that you're typing that in correctly if you guys do want to send me a Wobble Dog code. Um, so now let's go back into Wobble Dogs and see if this works. Okay, so as you guys can see, we're back in Wobble Dogs and going straight to storage. And down here, um, you guys don't really need to do this, but if I do end up sharing any of these dog codes, this is how you're going to do it. So you go to import dog and paste. See, so that's the code that I just copied. Press import. And that happens. Okay. Why is that like that? Huh. Bacon's code is the same, I believe. So, let's see. Oh, here we go. So, there we go. Just took me a couple tries for some reason. I don't know why, but as you guys can see, this is an exact copy of Bacon Storage. And now I have no clue which one was the original Bacon Storage. That's a slight problem, but there we go. So, I just imported Bacon Storage. I didn't have to copy anything from... Whichever bacon storage, what is this? Oh, that's cool, you can filter them. From whichever bacon storage was the original bacon storage, I honestly have no clue which one was which. Um, so yeah, that's how you do it, guys. If I do end up having a page um, or like a Google document or something where you guys can get all of our dogs, um, then that's how you guys can import them. Um, but if you guys do want to, um, kind of just, like, send me dog codes of the own, of your guys' own dogs that you have created, then that's how you do it. And just look at all of our wonderful, wonderful dogs. There's Pegasus, there's Unicorn, there's Porkchop, there's Blueberry, Blueberry, Blueberry Struggling. There's Chipmunk, and there's Punch. I'm sorry, guys. I really hope this helped. Um, thank you for just trying so hard to send me those Wobble Dogs codes. Um, but hopefully now you'll be able to do it. Also, Punch. Oh, dear. I think Punch has a sensitive stomach. Um, so, alright. I'm looking forward to seeing a ton of your guys' Wobble Dogs codes. So, just an egg. I'm just gonna click that. Um, tons of your guys' Wobble Dogs codes um, that we can import in our games. And also, your guys' name suggestions are also appreciated if you guys don't have Wobble Dogs. Um, so, alright. Nature Wolf out. <laughs>